What's going on YouTube? This is Virgil N with another video for you. Um, I want to call this one my movie gift collection because these were gifts based on my favorite movies that were given to me last Christmas. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. My older brother got me this particular item because he knew that I was a fan of this movie, The Mighty Ducks. It's one of those movies that you can't get sick of because you grew up watching it and you loved it a lot. So he went to my favorite store at the mall and picked up a District 5 Ducks t-shirt. Now this is the first logo that the team used in the movie before switching over to that that duck-faced helmet. Um, getting into the detail, you got those crazy funky colors with the captain C and the ducks on the bottom. On the back you have Conway number 96 played by Canadian actor Joshua Jackson. I wore this for St. Patty's Day, a lot of great compliments at the bar, so thanks to my brother for getting me a District 5 Ducks t-shirt. Definitely something to represent your childhood with. A uh, wonderful piece right here. Thanks again. Next up is, a, uh, is based on one of my other favorite movies that my younger brother got for me. He knew that I was a big fan of Slapshot. If you haven't seen Slapshot, do check it out. It's a really funny movie, classic hockey movie, and um, one of the most legendary actors, Paul Newman. Um, another one that I can't, uh, can't grow tired of. So he got me, my younger brother, he went to the mall and got me my Charlestown Chiefs replica jersey made by Mad Rose. Getting into the detail, you got the Chiefs in two-layer tackle 12 with the Charlestown All-American City patch. Now this was a custom job, um, I knew exactly who I wanted to get on the back and it was Reggie Dunlop, number 7, who was played by Paul Newman. It just, it just kind of was kind of my way to pay tribute to one of my favorite actors who passed away a couple of years ago. So, two layer tackle 207 on the back, as well as on the sleeves. It was done up exactly as it was in the movie. Avoiding the name bar. I've seen Dunlop jerseys with the name on the back and that just doesn't work for me You got to get it done exactly as it was to make it look a lot more authentic Another head turner great compliments when I picked this up special thanks to my younger brother for getting me this Charlestown Chiefs jersey So that's gonna do it for my video guys. Hope you liked it um, check out Murph's collectibles on Facebook as well as HTF Nation and the Kings of Throwbacks. Also check out my blog, I'll post up a link below at virgiln.blogspot.ca where you'll see a whole bunch of other jerseys in my collection as well as you know random entries and stuff like that. So uh, to all the YouTube subscribers, jersey lovers, jersey collectors, sports fans and movie fans, this is Virgil N. Take care.